Well, how are y'all doing? It's Pawpaw again. Lord have mercy. I am so thankful to all you people out there that subscribe to my channel. I have got 99,897 as of right this minute. 103 more and I hit that 100,000 get that plaque. So I appreciate all of you that's been watching my channel and that have subscribed. And uh, if you get a chance, please hit that subscribe button down there. Don't cost you nothing and it sure does make old Pawpaw feel good. Well, the video we're going to make today, this is on a, well, your little chicken coops. I, uh, I bought this little thing. It's only 9.8 feet by six and a half feet. So it's roughly a 10 by six or 10 by six and a half. And, uh, It's, you know, good enough for like four chickens, maybe a half a dozen, maybe a rooster and four hens. Uh, but it's that, uh, I like to call it the chain link fence type, you know, it's got the metal pipes and all that kind of stuff. And we're just going to, I'm going to let you know what I think about this whole fella. Now, there's a company out there called Bid FTA. That's B I D F T A. And uh, they've got all over the United States. I don't know where we're all right now, but a lot of places. And uh, go to bidfta.com and see if you can find a, a, uh, an auction in your area. Anyway, I bought this little feller uh, on the auction for $60. But by the time you add 17 and a quarter percent buyer's fee, 10% sales tax, all this other stuff, you might as well say I paid 80 bucks. So I paid $80 for this chicken coop run and it comes with enough uh, chicken wire to cover the entire thing plus a little flimsy top to throw over it. So we're gonna see how it works. So bear with me. And we'll, uh, I've got all my parts laid out, and we'll, we'll see if we can't eat this apple one bite at a time. If, oh, I, I, I gotta tell you now, I feel good. Well, oh, happy hemp has been doing me right now. Y'all so make sure you go to www.gethappyhemp.com, get you some gummy bears. Man, that makes me feel better. I can, I can actually, I can, I can move. <laughs> All right, I got all my parts laid out right there. It's real easy to snap this thing together. That little spring-loaded pins there. You got holes there. more than one way to hump a rabbit.
It's getting hot out here, so take off all your clothes. So I know it's hard for you to see this, but uh, this is all tied up there nice and taut. And uh, I'll just do the same thing on the other side. Oh, I got a big announcement. Big announcement. See, it's taken me a few days to do this video, and I have a, uh, uh, I've gone from when I told you I had 99,897 subscribers, as, as I speak to you right now, I've got 99,925, so I'm looking forward to hitting that 100,000 mark, and when I do, I'm going to cut off my whole beard. My beard's going to be gone. His long hair is going to be gone. I'm going to sit down with a barber and I'm going to say, I realize that you are a technician and not a magician, but try to make me look like a businessman. <laughs> So we're gonna we're gonna see old Paul Paul cleaned up professional this time. Every time before it's just been me and the dog shears. <laughs> Alright, I gotta put a piece of wire on the other side and I'll be done with this project. <laughs>
Well, folks, I got her done. That's a lot of damn work for this little old bitty thing. Uh, I'm thinking about using this like a chicken tractor. You know, move it around. But it's so lightweight. Hell, a dog can just lift it up with his nose. Maybe, uh, you know, this is probably good like in a back, somebody's backyard in a city where they just have a few little chickens and you know, can keep monitoring. I reckon if I uh, keep it set up out here, if I don't put a fence around it to move it around in here, I might, I might set this on, on four by fours like I did my, uh, uh, greenhouse well folks I appreciate the heck out of y'all watching and this video is gonna be the last time you see this my sister-in-law's here she's a licensed barber and she's gonna she's gonna I told her I said I realize you can't make a silk purse out of a sow's ear she says, hell, I can't even make a polyester pocketbook with what I got to work with of you. <laughs> anyway, folks, I really appreciate you watching the video. I, I hope that educated you a little bit. I don't know that I'd buy one of these again, but, you know, if you ain't got nothing else, it's good. Y'all have a wonderful day, and I'll better tomorrow. Bye, everybody.